Right, hello everyone and welcome to the stream. The winner this week, as you can see, is Don't Starve. So let's make a start on this one. Right, we've got to day seven. My record so far has been day eleven, so well, let's see if we can beat it today. Hello Michelle, welcome to the stream. Nice to see you here. So I haven't played this in a little while, so I have no idea where we are, but I, I seem to recall we were running short of food. So, wandering off and going find... Oh, that's right. Yes, we were going to go and activate this touchstone in the morning. But, uh... Let's cook a few things up. In the meantime, we need to survive the night. Any more food? No, nope, lots of poop, but no food. Okay, so let's eat those. Hello, Alice. Hello. Those muffalo over there. Yeah, they're muffalo over there. I have pretty much an idea where I am now. Yes, these are these are the muffalo fields down here. Still want to know what that touchstone is, and my base is up here somewhere. Up here. So we shall have to see how we go with that. Come on. Uh, actually, we've got a bit of time. Let's grab a tree while we're waiting. King Crawler! Hello! I do apologise, this is probably uncomfortably early for you, but uh, it's getting late for me. It's almost my bedtime. Come on, set sun, rise sun. We have lots and lots to do today. Another tree while we're at it. My body ahead, no. Oh. We'll do that later on. Um, I've had a, a good week. Uh, yes, thank you very much for asking. Jess of 500, hello, congratulations. It's uh, not everyone that can get uh, um, Twitch to load. I certainly can't half the time, so well done there. Come on. I have a bedtime, yes. For some reason I'm feeling a bit tired today. I don't know why. Might be something to do with the fact I was up till 3 o'clock in the morning entertaining you guys, but... Uh, that was my stupid idea, so who am I to blame? <laughs> yeah, Twitch likes putting its adverts up. There's not that much I can do about it, unfortunately, apart from say, hey, okay, I'll take all the money, thank you very much. Which I don't particularly want to do yet. There we go. Oh, just... okay. Let's have those seeds. And let's have that poop. Anything else especially nice? Might as well finish cutting down that tree. Right. My big worry now is food. But as promised, let's see what this does. Examine touchstone. An odd looking stone. Okay, that was anticlimactic. Let's go find some food. Got that stinger. I don't know what that is. Hello, Demonster764. Welcome to the stream. I have absolutely no idea what it was. Alright, let's... Today's priority is going to be food, so I'm going to wander away from where I normally go. And he says wandering places he's been before, so let's go southwards. Um, I need to go and give the, the food up here time to re rebuild so we're going to be wandering off into new areas straight away and see what we can see tempted to jump into a wormhole but that's probably a foolish idea at this point no don't want to fight a bee oh 
Oh, give me some yummy food. <laughs> Don't starve. The quest for a chip shop. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Oh, uh, dear. So, how's everyone doing today? Hello, Shizzy. Hello. Yeah, they're called beefaloes in this game. They're called muffaloes in RimWorld. And it all gets rather confusing, to be totally honest with you. Oh, give me some... Oh, here you go. A carrot. That over there. Uh, it's a mushroom. It hasn't grown yet. Pigman. Oh, do you have a farm, Mr. Pigman? No, you don't. How disappointing. Oh, give me some food. I don't want that. It'll kill me. But the amount of food I'm finding at the moment is going to kill me soon, if nothing else, as well. Oh, just a bush. Strange glomerous statue. Okay, well, if you're not sure what that's supposed to be, and I'm not sure what that's supposed to be, let's go talk to this bush instead. Hello, bush. Well, thanks for coming along. Much must appreciate it. Uh, um, I do appreciate the fact that my UK uh, uh, time zone habits make it a little bit harder for uh, people in America to come along. But I don't particularly want to play a start too much later because I have a uh, quite a few Scandinavian, Norwegian, other European followers. So uh, I'll do my best to please everyone if I can. Ooh, who are you? Pink King. Hello. <laughs> More of a pyramid than Oh, this is interesting. Oh, thank you very much. Any more food to grab around here? No, and it's getting dark, so let's make a fire quickly. And let's cook up some of this food. I haven't found a huge amount of food, but uh, um, enough to feed him overnight at the very least. Two of those, and where's those berries? There we go. <laughs> Just stream 24-7. Yeah, okay. Simon Parsons Parsons Broadcasting. All rubbish all of the time. Actually, that makes me think of something. I was having a, a chat with a few people. Um, oh, he's almost full, so that's good. That'll see him through the night and give us a bit more time during the morning. Let's have a quick look at these when we have a chance. Happened to the head. <laughs> really captures his personality. Okay, we'll probably have to knock down some of those later. Oh, seeds, right? Those, thank you. Um, I don't know. I can I could spend uh, six hours snoring at you guys while uh, a game's running in the background. Wouldn't that be fun? I'm sure you'd enjoy that. I'm sure you would. Where are we? And we'll be doing time. Okay, so. We've got a long way to come back. If we take a decent route back up, we can check these uh, traps and build another field. And hopefully the field there will have uh, grown all right. Is there anything else around here I can grab quickly before it does get dark? Put some seeds there. We'll have those. It's nice. Tempted to kill a pig, but there's an awful lot of them here, so perhaps not. I shall exercise the cowardice. Have I ever had to pimp slap anyone? No, I have never had to pimp slap anyone. <laughs> that was a very odd question. Okay, so, alright, alright, getting dark, come on. Let's get over till morning. Actually, I'll tell you what, I'm bored. Let's go and hit one of those with a hammer.
I can't hit them with a hammer. Ouch. Not fair. I'll try not to starve, stroke, die while you're away. Make another one of those. That was a bit wasteful, but never mind. Actually, I'll grab that. Uh, not entirely certain what it's for. Oh, seeds, have those. Excellent. What on earth is that? Berry bush. Hmm, interesting. It's not like a berry bush I've seen. <laughs> I will try not to steal your signature move, King Crawler. I, I promise you that. Now your, your signature move is safe from me. Come on. There we go. Put it all. Dance around the campfire. Try not to dance through the campfire because that would probably kill me knowing this game. Right, uh, okay, halfway through the night. And then we can start doing things again. The first thing I want to do is go and have a look at that bush and gather all the berries off of them and see if I can pick one up, as a matter of fact. What's my favourite game at the moment? Um, oh, good question. I'd have to say I'm seriously on a Minecraft bender. Um, that, Space Engineers, and things like that are... Um, things that I'm playing an awful lot of at the moment. I wonder why these bushes are different. And I like the fact they're growing so close together. It means we're at least we're going to eat. I think we will take one back for further analysis. Alright, right, where's the shovel? Okay, that's, we'll just take the one for now. We can always come back for more. And let's carry something that looks a bit like a weapon. That'll do. And let's wander our way back up. See what we can find. The big problem with Minecraft is... Um, in all honesty, is the fact that they just drop you in the middle of nowhere and say, get, get, get on with it. Um, it's very hard for people to do without support. Uh, I mean, admittedly, once if you can do it, then you're fully justified in being smug. Maybe you're right. Nope. You're wrong. Uh, any Marvel fans? Reasonably so. I used to like the cast, the, the comics. Um, if it's about me not following the films, it's it's not Marvel. It's the fact I just don't watch films that much. I prefer books or computer games or things like that. Um, oh, you killed me, axe! How dare you! Um, yes, the game is to survive without starving. Yeah, that would that would be a bit unfortunate, I've got to admit. Poop tickler! <laughs> Hello, and very, very interesting name. Welcome to the channel. Merlin's Child 82! Uh, hello, CreeperZone007. Hello, VKitty85. Hello, I don't think I've, I've, I've missed anyone else. If I have, shout out, I shall say hello. Uh, we're playing Don't Starve. We have just been for a run looking for food. We picked up a load of berries. Now we're heading back to base.
Um, what do I watch? I, I watch Doctor Who. Um, I I get teased quite a lot because the other thing I watch on TV is the Eurovision Song Contest because I find it absolutely fantastic. Oh, berries. Uh, but that's pretty much my TV watching. One of those. Oh, can't carry any more stuff. Let's drop something. Rocks, flints. Um, yeah, let's drop those and let's plant those actually. There'll be trees when I come back. Where are we? Uh, we are heading a long way away from where we need to be, so let's head back as a matter of fact. Get a bit of uh, closeness to home before we build this fire. Let's keep an eye on the uh, torches. So, what superpower would I have, and uh, why? Um, I suppose the uh, the traditional answer here is invisibility. For the obvious reasons, but no, that's that's not not that's the superpower I would have. Um, if I was to pick a superpower, I'd pick money. Because let's face it, with if you've got enough money, you can do just about anything else. And so it's a superpower all of itself. And if you don't believe me, look at Batman. Look at Iron Man. Uh, what is their superpower? Cash. Seems to work for them. Of the modern doctors, I think I preferred Matt Smith eventually. I initially disliked him, but uh, got to like him eventually. Um, David Tennant was a, a, a very, very good Doctor, I thought, but Matt Smith had ooh, a bit more silliness. Do I like pancakes? Absolutely. And is there anywhere around here that sells them? Well, to be totally honest with you, Oh, I've lost that now as well, have I? To be totally honest with you, where I live, no, there isn't normally. Uh, but um, during December, there's something called Christmas Market, and one of the one of the shop one of the stalls there every year is this place that sells incredible pancakes and Belgian waffles and things like that. And uh, well worth taking the time to go into Southampton to go there. And it's nearly dark, so let's actually stop here and make a fire. There we go. Okay, and let's cook up some of this food. I don't want to cook more than I have to because uh, I'm running out of space, but uh, let's see how much we need to eat. That was a bit sad. Uh, grits is interesting. Um, if you were to uh, point out to people that grits is basically uh, um, coarsely rolled flour, it's somewhere between um, flour and semolina, if I remember rightly. It's a uh, it, it, it's actually uh, the basis of a decent meal. I mean, certainly if you've never eaten grits, uh, especially as a European, if you've never eaten grits, I would say go and try it. Go and find it and go and try it. You know, it's uh, it, it's it's certainly it's certainly worth looking at, and it's as as America as an American a piece of American culture more than anything else. It is definitely worth looking up and seeing because. Um, you yeah, know, it's, it's, it's the basis of, of many, many foods. Nobody's taken that bait. Um, let's go out and see the other one. 